Hello darlings and welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Peace Nina, aka Nenani Wewu. It's been a while, darlings. I have been busy and I have been down too. I've been busy with some things. I've been super busy and I I was not feeling so fine, but I am fine now. I missed you guys. I hope you guys are fine too. Guys, I got my hair done the other day. I got a new hairstyle. Um, it's still actually very painful. That's why I'm not packing it very well. I hope you like it. This is like one of my favorite hairstyles and um, I get to carry for long. Like, I don't like making my hair. Not like I don't like making my hair, but it's actually painful when I'm whenever I'm making my hair. So I actually love this one because whenever I make it, I'll get to carry for some time before talking about making another hair. How do I look? Do you like it? Rainy seasons are actually not a good time for me. All those tiny tiny flies, they bite my my skin like I don't know if you can see it. They bite it so much and leave that dark spots on it. You need to see my legs. Jesus Christ. They have finished my skin. Like whenever they bite me, I don't usually scratch them all. But they will so swell up and after a day or two, it will start bringing out water. Uh, and as time goes on, it will dry up and leave those dark, dark spots on me. It's actually painful. I don't know what to use and remove those um, black spots and sometimes it will even make me get sick. I think this is one of the things that is even me, giving me this um, malaria. It's not mosquito or the sunfly, those tiny, tiny ones. Anyways guys, this is not why I am here. Who is watching Big Brother Niger reunion show? Hey! <laughs> They was woes everywhere was woes. Stay tuned and I'll be right back. I think Kayode has some apologies to make to us. Like we subscribed our DSTVs, our Go TVs to get the whole details, to get the whole show. And Kayode was busy showing us bits and parts. Like he wasn't showing us everything. But this reunion, eh? <laughs> Hey, they're just giving us everything that happened back to back and funny enough most of them in fact most of them are admitting to it I actually thought it was mostly the guys that were after the ladies but this reunion eh, I can see that most girls in fact almost all of them were after the guys the one that shocked me most was that of Dorothy hey, hey Dora Dora like this is a show I wouldn't want to criticize anybody she was just playing her game and it worked for her but man she shocked me Dora wasn't actually what I thought she shocked me she shocked us did she shock you Erica um, was my best um, housemate. She was my favorite housemate. And to think that everybody was seeing her as the bad egg, like everybody was seeing her as the spoiled child in the house. Whereas some people were just doing some things in the corner. While my Erica was just being real, she was just being herself. She was just flaunting herself around kid wire and all. And just when I thought I have heard it all and I've watched it all, Katrina came with her own was was like hey anyways I suspected um, she and praise I think I knew they had it in the house but the way she talked about it like the way she talked about it hey praise I pitied praise oh I really pitied praise I was like one man has gotten a brother one man like that that um, two seconds man has gotten a brother <laughs> I didn't like V, I'll be honest, I didn't like V why she wasn't the house, but now I think I like that girl. Um, I think um, she she has this um, misunderstood personality. Tolani was so unfortunate. Tolani was so, so unfortunate. Like, she dragged herself by herself and V made sure she remained in that gutter. Like, hey, V is so blunt. Like, I didn't like her. I didn't like her. She, I think she doesn't know, she's this lady that doesn't know how to shape her mouth. 
to talk, you know. She just says it the way she feels like. But you see now, I like V. I like V. It's just that she just calm down a little. She be calming down. Like, she doesn't know how to talk. She just says it. Bwah! And that is it. Watoni. Hey, <laughs> Watoni, Watoni. Watoni was another unfortunate person. Watoni, everybody was just dragging Watoni. At a point, I even started beating the girl. Everybody was just dragging her. Everybody. In fact, last night, I think um, it was she and um, what was this guy's name? Um, Tochi. Tochi was just finishing her. Everything about you in the house was man. This one. Um, and Watoni was like, you told someone. I've forgotten who she said. Um, um, Tochi told that um, she's an easy catch. That she can. The guy. The person can actually go after Watoni and Watoni was trying to say that she wasn't an easy catch she's, she's not an easy catch that after all if she was Tochi would have caught her and Tochi was like furious that I didn't even come after you I didn't even ask you out why are you saying that I can't catch you when I didn't even ask you out like Tochi was so furious Tochi was so so furious I think Watoni should also be coming down like she was just everywhere she was just everywhere in this reunion. She, she, she should be coming down. Watoni lied about not liking Kid Wire. Uh, uh, until we all saw it, it was so obvious that he liked Kid Wire. And, he, and she even um, addressed him as a community guy. <laughs> hey, God, this is reunion. Eh? And don't you also said um, um, that Watoni is, uh, is also a community lady. Since she used that word on someone, she's also a community lady because everything about her in the house was all about men men man man you know brighto my guy like hey brighto oh shocked me like you know when brighto entered the house everybody saw him as this very cool quiet guy remember i'm not criticizing anybody here i'm not judging anybody is a shoe and everybody was just playing his or her game you know i mean like too much money was involved and everybody was trying to win so you wouldn't blame anybody you understand and um dorothy admitted to what Watoni um, said about she and Brito, like she had her mouth on Brito's body. Wow. And she said the next morning, Brito didn't even say hi. Like Brito didn't say even good morning to her. Brito was just acting like nothing happened last night. I think I understand where Dorothy was coming from and I also understand where Brito was coming from. But Brito would have just said good morning, just say hi. It's not a big deal. Like it's actually um it's actually painful. Like that lady had her mouth on your body in the night. You would have just said good morning and pass, even if you don't want to say any other thing to her. I think Kid Wire and Nengi played the same game, like they had the same game plan. Nengi was, I think for me, in my opinion, I think Nengi was leading some of the guys on just like Kid Wire. But Kid Wire claims that she um, that he is um, a playful person, which he is actually. But um last night, even Ebuka is shocked in this reunion, like Ebuka is so shocked. Katrina said um, Nengi was leading Kid Wire on, which um, Nengi didn't admit to that. He, she said um, 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 that um, Kid Wire is somebody that she doesn't have any feelings or emotions for, that that was why she was so free with Kid Wire and Kid Wire plays a lot too. Do you think Nengi was leading Kid Wire on or were they just having a friendly play and all of that? What do you think? Drop in the comment section, I'll be reading, okay? I also forgot that Dorothy said she didn't have any feelings for Ozo, Ah Ah, Auntie, Ah Ah. We all saw these things now. Anyway, this is my opinion. I feel she did, and and the reason why she stayed away was that I think Ozo um, was not and still not attracted to Dorothy physically. I think that was what happened. But for Dorothy to say she she didn't have any feelings for Ozo, that was a lie. In fact, that is a big lie, in my opinion, no, I don't know for anyone else. But in this reunion, I think I relearned something. Always watch what you say. 
always be careful while talking, especially in the public. It will be used against you. I give it to Nengi. Nengi's um, composure, she she actually comported herself so well in this reunion. She will just, they will ask her this one, Nengi will forget. They will ask her another one, Nengi will be like, oh, maybe I've forgotten. Maybe I, I can't remember when I said it. Maybe I've forgotten when I did it. Like she kept forgetting. <laughs> Babe, no one stories for future. Or try to act like somebody will just come out uh, tomorrow and start using something that she said uh, on the television against her. Like the internet never forgets. We will always remember. Internet will always remember. People will always remember. I can remember when um, a test message Test messages and chats that I sent out of anger was used against me and since then anything that will be recorded and anything that people can easily bring out tomorrow or pull up tomorrow to use against me I'm usually very careful with that though ha <laughs> it was not easy for me then but I've learned my lessons you know Dorothy, Katrina, and the rest of the ladies were all just feeling like all those um, very bold, outspoken ladies without knowing that they were giving out the things that can be used against them in the future. Let's be guided. They didn't even remember they will have kids in the future and I think Katrina already has a daughter. They didn't remember all of that. They didn't remember they can want to um, go for any position, political position in the future. They didn't remember that... Uh, there, there is something called future. They were just acting like um, bold, outspoken, boss chicks, you know. The moral lesson in this video is, please let's be guided, especially what we say to people, especially the ones that are recorded, especially the ones that are recorded. They might be used against us in future. Let's be guided while in public, while we're, record, while, while we're recording things and with um, text messages, WhatsApp or anything, or even on this um, YouTube self. I'm not happy people think all that biology and drag you out to be used against you, to be used against your children. Do you understand? So this is where we'll be ending it for today. I think I didn't even touch everything um, uh, on this reunion so far, but I just said let me just come in here, check up on you guys and just with you guys a little. Give this video a thumbs up, comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Please now subscribe. Subscribe and help this growing family to grow faster, okay? I remain your babe, peace, Nina. Nana, ni we wo. E gotta go, e gotta go. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye for now.